Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video Ethereum fans Today we are discussing how to buy Ethereum on Trust Wallet in 2024 whether you are participating in decentralized finance or just expanding your crypto holdings, join me as we navigate the steps to buy Ethereum on Trust Wallet. So guys, without further talking, let's get started. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So guys, the first thing that I'm gonna do is to head up to the Trust Wallet official website. So there we go, go to Trust Wallet on your browser and click on trustwallet.com that will be the first link to appear. After that, you will notice that this uh, wallet is basically either an extension or a mobile app. So it's not really a program that you can soft or a software that you can download on your PC. So what we're gonna do in our case is simply gonna download it as an extension on our PC. So head up right here Choose download extension, choose your browser and click on it. And here we go. So here it is. Now it has 900k uh, users, which is a very decent amount of people and makes sense since it is the official uh, like extension. Now after that, you will face here like a button that will ask you to add this extension. Just click on it and then the extension will be added to your browser in a few seconds. After that, what you will do is to click on it like that, but for you, it would be something like that. It will be, uh, it will open a new tab for you with Trust Wallet on it, and they will ask you to create your account. So you have to create your new wallet on Trust Wallet. So basically, it wouldn't take a lot of time from you. You just have to actually understand how to manage it. So you simply have to put password twice, email and copy the recovery phrase which will be given to you. After that, your account should be created and a page like that should be opened for you. Now let's make it full screen, just like so. And here we go. So guys, in this specific video, we are going to try to buy Ethereum. Now to buy Ethereum guys is pretty simple. Don't worry about it, we're gonna explain it all. So, the first thing when you open your wallet, you will find here all of this list of tokens. So, you can click here to manage tokens and find Ethereum shortcuts which could be added. So, let's for example remove this, remove that, remove this, and yeah, let's try to find Ethereum here. Uh, yeah, here it is. So you can click right here and for example, click on receive in case you would like to receive it from someone. So this this is also a method which you could use to actually have Ethereum in your account, which is receiving instead of buying. So you could send to someone money, cash or send it by bank and receive the money from him. So the way how it works exactly is by giving the guy or the person that you will, he will send you the money or Ethereum this address. So each token has its own address. Make sure guys that you don't send, for example, Ethereum token to someone who's going to send you USDT or USDC or Bitcoin. They are total different tokens. Each one has its own token. So. This is a way or a method that you could use or you can simply click here to buy it. Now what if you couldn't find this buy uh, button or Ethereum in here, what you could do simply is click right here on this buy and sell button from this area. So let's click on it and here we go. So here simply just put the amount of money that you're gonna spend. So for example, I'm going to spend 2000 uh, of X currency, let's say for example Saudi Real. So here we go, Saudi Real. And as you can see, these two accept this. Okay, this one accepts Saudi Real. Let's try to choose something that is not acceptable. I think Mad wasn't acceptable. Yeah, this one. So yeah, for example, this one is not acceptable right now or it's not available. So sometimes as I'm going to show in this video, tokens or some coasters which are basically the third party providers because Trust Wallet doesn't really own any USDT or it's not a platform of trading, it's just a wallet. So when you're trying to buy, they're going to search for providers that's going to sell you these tokens. So when you are trying, for example, to buy using this currency, which is not acceptable by all of the other uh, providers that this wallet has, well then you will have zero quotas. So put that in mind, some currencies would be able to give you uh, either, even uh, like, uh, <coughs> for example, uh, like, what do we call it in general? 
um, a suggestion for example yeah they wouldn't give you like a price even for the ethereum or in general uh, it will be so high in price so what we do usually is to convert our currency to usd because usd has always all providers accepting it and basically they will give you the best prices when it comes to this kind of stuff so here we go now we have to choose usd make sure guys that you are on buy not on sell which is very important and choose the currency which is in our case gonna be the ethereum currency after we did these two options make sure to choose the one that will fit you for example you can click on this one for example this one is not working so what you have to do is to wait another time until something appears we can write here 150 so when you lower for example the price other will, uh, will like appear to you for example we have here transac and we have banksa so let's check them out both and see which one is actually gonna work for us so there we go both of them are actually working so let's go with this one the first one which is trans uh, transact so in transact here uh, automatically the price is going to be with the price that you have put in trust wallet and the currency will be of course with the one that you have chosen in trust wallet and you can't really change them so here we have the payment method we have visa card or mastercard we have gpay which is google play google pay and we have the cash app so here the cash app you can choose it you can choose visa and you can choose one of uh, and there's also apple pay but apple pay since i'm not using for example iphone ipad or macbook or uh, safari browser then i don't have really the access to use it in case you have one of these then you will be able to use them then here it is the amount of ethereum that you have that you will get eventually click on buy now and you will simply be taken to a process where you have to put your informations from the first name the last name mobile number and date of birth click on continue after you do that and the next thing is to put your address so where do you live for example state region city postal zip code and uh, country then continue so you have to put here why are you using transic and then finally your your security social number social security number so after you do that you will be provided with a page where you will simply provide your for example if you were going to use mastercard visa card you have to provide your card number name uh, cvc and expiration date so these are very uh, important things to put so you can buy your uh, cryptocurrencies or the ethereum after you do that you will receive the money uh congratulations you have bought it successfully and you will receive your money in here in this wallet just make sure to refresh or refresh the page itself and you will receive it inside of your wallet so congratulations you have bought your first ethereum so yeah guys that was it for today's tutorial if you enjoyed make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel and see you guys in the next tutorial Bye bye